Hi folks, um, in this video I'm going to show you how to use the like and star operators in ClickView. So I'm just going to crack on so you can see what I'm talking about. I've got two list boxes. Um, in the second list box I'm going to create a an expression. So I'm going to say if name like um, McDonald's comma McDonald's comma nothing. So basically, if the name is like McDonald's, give us back uh, this answer. If it's not, give us back a, a blank. So if you click OK and we make a selection here, you can see that it's only picking up one field over here. So we need to add another if statement. So we could say to pick up, because we said if we look at the expression. In the first if statement we said where it's like Mac with a space. So if we add another if statement in here. So if name like and then just McDonald's all one word comma McDonald's comma space and then just close the second if statement. Click OK. So now we make a selection, it should now be picking up all of these fields. So we have another field here called M Donalds. We could, if you wanted, add another if statement. Say if name like M Donalds. It doesn't matter what case it's in because we're, we're changing it because it's like. McDonald's, comma space, close it, tour this statement. So we click OK and make a selection. It's now picking up all of these as one field here called McDonald's. Now we could do this in the script, but it's, I'm trying to show you how, how it's used in an expression um, in the front end rather than the script. So it, it is a bit long winded so I'm going to show you a quicker way we could instead of doing these three if statements we could just um, we could use star in, in at the start here so we know they all contain uh, Donald's so we could go back to the start here and delete that and then after the first comment put in the star and at the, after the S for Donald's put in the star and then say comma blank so two single quotes means give back nothing so we click OK click OK, OK again we click clear now it's doing the same thing but the expression is much smaller it's just one if statement so what we could do then is we could actually edit the expression and here say if name like A B C comma so I'm going to change them all to uppercase A B C you could use the upper function but I'm trying to demonstrate the, the use of the like um, Okay. So now we're getting if we choose ABC, we're getting ABC and ABC, if we choose McDonald's, we're getting McDonald's, so we can add one more um one more if statement to that and say comma if name like CDF comma CDF just close that tour this statement so click OK click OK again so now instead of having uh, this name field over here we could just add a title say name we've now got um, the name field with only three values in it instead of nine values or eight values wherever it is and if you make our selection it's picking up these values so I hope that helps and I'll see you next video cheers